Something that actually gets on my nerves is the perception that people have of Jurgen Klopp as this happy-go-lucky guy. He's actually not. He's a right moaning sod. He's constantly moaning about something. And this love affair that the British media have with him is quite irritating. I think he's a pretty bitter guy. And I think it's shown with his obsession with Manchester United and our penalties. And we've obviously got a story here I'm referring to recent comments that he made in January where he said, I quote, I hear now that Manchester United have more penalties in two years than I have in five and a half years. And then <clears throat> Oli has responded yesterday at the press conference for the Aston Villa match and said, there are certain managers last year who are starting to worry about us getting penalties and that it seems like decisions are more difficult to give. United had two stonewall penalties in their 2-1 win against West Ham. There's no doubt about that. And, it, and I also probably think that we should have had a penalty on in the Wednesday night Carabao Cup game. And, you know, I, I, Solskjaer also said, surely I've seen a big, big difference since then on. But we, we just have to leave it up to the refs and hope that they make the right decisions very soon. We're facing Aston Villa on Saturday today. And, you know, we really need the standard of refereeing to improve. But I think that this is a sign that the image that people like Klopp have as being like this happy-go-lucky sort of like ha-ha-ha funny guy, this, this fucking clown basically, is just nonsense. You know, there is certain pressure on referees, right? They don't like Man United getting fair decisions. There's no doubt about it. And the referees need to be stronger and they need to understand what their role is. And they need to be able to give decisions based upon the play, not based upon the reputation of the player, based upon the pressure that's being asserted by other managers and other teams.